What's up, guys? Blind Spawn Vlog. I'm here again yet with another banana plant video. This one on the Super Dwarf Banana. I know I've been doing a lot of banana updates lately, last day. But since I got back from vacation, there's a lot of updating needed to happen on these guys. Because these are really exciting plants. And they're doing some crazy stuff right now. Like this one right here. This is the Super Dwarf. Uh, one of the smallest banana varieties ever. I only guess the two feet max. It's approaching that. And I think it's beginning to... It's hitting the mature stage now, as you can see. Uh, these leaves are stacking right on top of each other now. They're not necessarily spiraling anymore like they used to. Here's some older leaves down here. As you can see, back in, back, back in a while ago, they were actually having quite a lot of boom, and then they shot out from this side. But then look, they're stacking now. One on top of the other. And that's usually an indicator that the stem is getting robust and Normally you see that when a plant is being ready to flower the next, uh, like over halfway. And uh, you can see that really nicely here. You can also see that I think the leaves are getting shorter with each leaf, just a little bit. Could be wrong, could be an illusion, but they do kind of look like they're getting shorter. Doesn't it look like they're getting shorter? Each new leaf that comes out is slightly shorter than the last leaf. I think that's what it looks like. And if that is the case, then we've got a really, really nice um, news because that means it's getting ready to flower uh, in not too terribly distant future. Because as these leaves are get shorter, if that's what's happening, they're not getting longer, that's for sure, or else you would see that. But if they are getting shorter, then it would get to a point where it would get so short that they have a little tiny leaf and then a the flower would come out. Though, I'll we'll have to see if that's the, tr the case here. But it does look like that's happening. You can see. This leaf, older leaf, is shorter than this leaf, and this leaf looks like it's gonna come out shorter than this leaf. Just a little bit, not much. Uh, this leaf's almost unfurled now. And uh, they don't really have much of an extent, they don't have very long petioles. Look at that, you can see the petioles are basically non-existent on this variety. And uh, yeah, see the petioles? Yeah, petioles are the stem that connects the leaf to the um, stem. You can also see that um, they don't, they're not very wind, they don't tear in the wind. Right there is a good example of the wind coming through. They always have perfect leaves, unless you like rip them yourself. But uh, yeah, they don't tear in the wind at all. But here's another, here's a look at the pup. Look at that, guys. That guy's looking good. It's a few inches tall now. And I'm about to go over here, I can kind of have a view of it. Leaves are getting a little bigger. Another pup right there is coming up. Um, but uh, yeah, hopefully this guy flowers in the next um, three to four months. I'll give it time. I've never seen one of these flower before. Uh, I've heard of them flowering, but very rarely. There's not very many forums on these types of bananas flowering. Either that because they're rare to flower, or they die before they flower, or um, you know, there's just a lot of other factors that could lead to them not flowering. Some people have these and then they go they go into winter and then they don't take care of them properly and they die before in the winter and then they get like, you know, oh, they didn't flower. I don't know. We'll see. How I'm gonna overwinter this guy is simple. But I'm gonna put him in the garage in the container and I'm going to put like 400 grow lights on it. <laughs> Literally, like I'm gonna put like tons of grow lights around it and that should be ample enough to it to keep growing. Yeah, guys, that's the update on the Super Dwarf. Another update coming out for a while. I won't give an update for a while on this guy. It's been two weeks since the last one, so I figured I would just wait again. But yeah, these leaves do look like they're getting, definitely getting shorter. Look at that. Shorter than this one down here. Just a little bit, not much, but we'll see. Really interesting stuff. See you next time, guys.